global digital experience now within these next two days with groundbreaking products, groundbreaking developments, groundbreaking strategies. So that means you will have the possibility to build up your community or business so big like you never ever you could have done that before. You're interested in that? Yes. Yeah? You like it? You love it? I love it. Yeah? So that means let us invite on the stage a very, very special person. I know him since more than 10 years. He was really good friends, or I was getting a good friend in the meantime. He has built up huge communities in the last 25 years. He has lived in the United States. He has led in huge sales forces, was in very, very high positions on corporate levels in huge companies. So he brings with him a lot of experience. And I love him for how he's doing the things. No? With integrity, he's doing it day and night, he's absolutely focused. And of course, he's also an expert in fintech. And fintech, of course, have to do a lot with that, what we are all not doing together. So let him welcome on the stage with a big welcome, of course, the chief sales officer of the My Mail Group, Shawlooka Lim. that is losing me, is, is actually is, is a bind on me. But uh, today is a very special day. I feel privileged, honored, but also there is a big responsibility. <clears throat> and all of you, it's only around a thousand people upon eight billion people on the planet that will see something that never happened before in many different industries. And sometimes big stuff start small by chance with a little bit of magic for reasons that you weren't expecting and as Werner introduced before uh, it happened because of my birthday party how funny is that so we're all here because I had a birthday party <laughs> so last year in June yeah, I, I threw a party because I was turning 50 and I invited a bunch of people, friends, common friends, business people, and other people related to me. And great party, VIPs, some celebrities, you know, Monaco, Monte Carlo is a cool place to go. Who have been to Monaco before? Okay, so this year, probably all of you, if you put some sweat, you all go to Monaco and see what's kept happening there. But uh, who wants to go to Monaco and see how it is? Yes or what? Yes. Good. And so at this party, uh, so at this party, uh, I meet Werner again through a common friend uh, that actually I thank. He's here in the room. Um, after many years, I haven't seen Werner. He he got back in touch with me. And we start talking, having some drinks, and sharing stories. And uh, you know, it's easy when business people meet talking about what you do, talking about your, your business path, your life path, uh, changes many years have passed since we met. Actually, Werner was one of my role models when I started into some businesses many years ago. And, uh, and so I was sharing how excited I was of what we did in the last few years. And I was starting talking about our company, my new group. My new group is a FinTech trendsetter. Who have heard about my new group? Let me see, let me see, what? Many people in the room, good. 
So my new group started to actually ease the transition between traditional finance and digital finance. And the idea to do this is actually putting together a realm of services, uh, of fintech solutions, where we can actually uh, become uh, the, the, the game changer in delivering these kind of services to the market. And with a more than 10 years experience, we actually started uh, approaching the retail market in uh, a different way. And that's how actually, in the conversation with Werner, uh, we had a spark of an idea. And the spark is that now, you know, the difference, you make the difference, and the really big turning point in any business in the digital world is community. So Werner was start talking about communities and what he was doing uh, with his company, and uh, you know, I knew where he was coming from and all his experience. And we were actually already stepping into this world where communities are the key of actually showing people, educating the people how to actually transition and use the services. But there's always a tipping point where many, many companies do not have what we have. And I started realizing, talking to Werner and also later on with other entrepreneurs, that we had a chance to become stronger, bigger, and better for the sake of the people. How you like that? Yes or yes? yes. I didn't hear you. Yes. Good, just better. So, one of the things that makes a difference in our world is licenses. We have 40 licenses, we have many different ecosystems, we have a team of more than 300 people working with us, and we are trying so hard and in the proper way to ease this transition between regular finance to digital finance, being compliant. Is it important or what, being compliant? Yes or yes? Yes. I think it's vital. Are you with me? Yes. Are you with me or what? Yes. Thank you. It's very important you have to stay focused today because it's going to be a very intense day that will change your life forever. Yes. So, you know, this fintech universe is very vast. So, we, as I said, we start with fintech services, but we also put together different kind of solutions that can actually help our people to walk this path between I, you know, used to go to the bank, open a bank account, do this and that, and have a crypto wallet, or maybe I need to transfer currencies from fiat to crypto, crypto to fiat, all these solutions that when you go out there, almost nobody has. And uh, on top of this, walking this path, we saw that it's very important also to have uh, a very profound asset management task. So we have a family office in Monaco, we manage 3.8 billion in uh, uh, forex options as a strategy. We manage also physical stuff like real estate, boats, jets, and so forth. This is very important because you close the circle with the trust, with the institutional presence in the financial market. And as you can see, one of the foundations in all this path is absolutely being uh, a revolutionary entity in the landscape because if you don't groundbreak the industry, you will copy and paste whatever is found there. And as you saw, probably you are all aware of this, this digital industry, especially blockchain and all the surrounding uh, venues are growing very fast. It's hard to keep the pace. So you have to be fast, you have to be ready, you have to have a, have a steady base. And so to do this, we need top partners. These are some of our top partners, cutting edge uh, companies are all around the world that bring to our ecosystem and our customers and our partners something that out there is all sparse here and there in many, many companies. Now it's all conveyed in my new group. This is a, one of our strengths. So some of our companies and services, you can see on the screen, we have our own bank, it's called Banca Neo. Do not go and open a bank account now, please. Okay? <laughs> Banca Neo is a bank for international business, <clears throat> working in more than 160 countries. Uh, and there's a, a surprise coming tomorrow, I'm not gonna tell you today, in the banking area. Then we have a, a digital platform that bonds crypto and fiat. It's called My Neo Dash. 
and many, many other so solutions as uh, you can see, traveling platform, educational platform, and so forth. But, you know, I don't want to make a long story too short because I think, you know, every one of us has a story that he brings here. I would like to, you know, share with some of you, but we don't have time today. Why did you come? Why were you here? Why, why, why did you take a flight or a car or a train or a boat or whatever you took to come here? Because somebody invited you. What did you feel when you've been invited? Well, what are you expecting? And I think that expectations has a tipping point where they have, they must be matched. Yes or yes? Yes. Yes or yes? Yes. Yes or yes? Yes. Oh, I want some energy, guys. I told you, this is not going to be the same anymore. We are here to make history. What we're going to see today and tomorrow has never been done ever. I like it. That's how I like it. <laughs> so, you know, to reach greatness, you need to put together the right minds. No, have you ever heard of something like Brain Alliance? Who have heard of Brain Alliance? You know, you put together the right brains and so you can make different decisions, better decisions. You perform well, you find solution. Problems are always overcome. Because if you become stronger, you become also better, more also confident. And you can face all these difficulties that we see in this kind of market. You know, traditional finance is still huge. It's 95, 97% of the market. But we are raising up. And to raise up faster, we have to become united, stronger. And so at that party in Monaco, Werner said, you know, I'm here with some friends. And there's a guy I start doing business with. And this guy is a genius. In only three and a half years, he put together a company that revenue one billion. How you, like, how you like that? Yes or yes? Yes. yes? yes. So I was eager to meet this guy. And I was like, drinks and wine. So Jesus, I had to like compose myself a little bit. This guy made one billion in three and a half years. So I sit down with the guy and uh, it was like laid back, smart. He looks like Superman. You see, no, not with the, uh, the cloth, but he's a great guy like this. And, uh, and he has this vision about tokenization, blockchain for everybody. And I was stunned. So please give a warm round of applause for Every Doctor, CEO and founder of USXF. So still a baby, oh, um, and I want to tell you a little bit about this special birthday party. Who knows about the, the law of attraction? Yes. Who knows about the law of attraction? Very good. So you know that every cell have a different frequency, and sometimes when you meet different people, there are some people you like, some people you like a little less, some people you don't like, and then you meet some people and say, wow. There is a special connection. Yeah? You have the same frequency. This frequency connects sometimes people. And with this birthday party, there was a lot of same frequencies. Yeah? So big thanks, not to Gianluca, big thanks to the mother from Gianluca, Mama Bin, who was responsible that this party ever happened. So big applause for the mom. <laughs> so out of this birthday party, I had the honor to meet a lot of interesting people. Gianluca and also the Neon Group. 
and I was very, very happy to have this introduction. And a lot of great things came out of this person party, and a lot of same frequencies that I will share a little bit later, a second person with the same frequency. So I was very happy. We started to talk about blockchain, digitalization, and the introduction of Neon, the crypto bank, Banca Neon. And then we saw there are a lot of synergies. And we decided to merge, go together, and to create Neo Semtech. Neo Semtech was our first, yeah, you can, thanks. Our first uh, project together where we said, okay, let's combine the synergies, let's combine the energy. And we decided to have a common vision in this company to say, okay, what do we want to do with this company? It's a blockchain company where we want to push everything forward. We have the same vision. We want to be big. We want to have tools and possibilities so that everybody can use the blockchain technology. Everybody in the world. Until now, approximately 95% are not using it. So all the people here, you're one of the 5% who knows how to use cryptocurrencies. You know how to use blockchain technology. You understand what is tokenization. And this is very important because you are the early adopters. And one of the important things, one of the visions that we had was to say, okay, we want to be the company who is creating mass adoption. Mass adoption means it has to be as simple as possible so that also Mama Bin in the future can use our technology, our tools. Yeah? And this was the vision. So we started to work together and we had already some achievements. So we have six different products in our ecosystem, an amazing blockchain which has 30,000 transactions per second, we have more than half a million uh, users. EVM, very important, EVM compatible. So that means that every, every developer on Ethereum, on any other blockchain, can program the same language on both blockchains. It's solidity. And this helps a lot. So they can really copy paste what they, do, what they have done on the Ethereum blockchain and bring it to our blockchain. And we have a little bit more than 100 people, two offices, one in Dubai and one in Zug in Switzerland. Here a quick overview about our ecosystem. So we have on one side hardware device, we have our Nomo app, which is a decentralized app. We have debit cards, we have a staking technology, swap function, we have a Cynic swap. We have a coin token listed on different exchanges. We have the ThankCon event, which is a hackathon for developers, like Olympic Games for all the developers, and Web3 applications. So here, a quick story about what happened in the last few years, since 2018, when the project started. 2018 was the year uh, where I was sitting with a very good friend, the CTO, together, and discussing about what he's doing, and uh, that I'm interested in joining a blockchain project. So the idea was to create a hardware device with a decentralized exchange. 